This is Adam Want, professor and technologist from John Jay College of Criminal Justice, part of the City University of New York. And I'm here today to unbox and review the Lacy Too Big Thunderbolt Series uh, RAID storage drive. I have the six terabyte model here and we're going to unbox it and review it right now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna break the seal in the back. And let's open it up and see what's inside. All right, so looks like the main drive and we have an accessory component, an accessory box. Here's the accessory box. There's a quick install guide printed right on the accessory box. We'll open this box up in a second and take a look what's in it. The main drive is right here. It pulls out nice and easily. It's incredible how they fit everything right into this box. There was virtually no wasted space at all within the box. Let's put this aside. And the Lacy Too Big Drive is right here. As you know, it's called the Too Big Drive because it has two large SATA drives right on the back, uh, labeled one and two. On the back, we also have two Thunderbolt ports, which allows for chaining, uh, a power adapter, and this looks like an out fan. Uh, it's an all aluminum enclosure, which I really like. The all aluminum enclosure really dissipates heat much better than plastic. In the front, we have the iconic Lacy blue button, which uh, could run some scripts if we needed to. And on the bottom, we have a bracket that's installed that allows it to sit a little higher than the actual desk itself. It, br it brings it up off the desk for a little bit of ventilation along the bottom. So I'm going to put this aside for a second and we're going to look at the accessory package next. So let's open up this accessory box and see what's inside. On the cover is a quick stall guide. It couldn't be easier to install this device. When we open it, let's see now, we see that the C gave us power adapters uh, for worldwide travel. It looks like we have virtually every single type of power adapter in this box, which is great. Let's take this out. Here's the US power adapter. Looks like they also gave us a Thunderbolt cable, which is wonderful. And wrapped here in bubble wrap is our power adapter. There's also some literature, what looks to be a reset key, and then an Allen wrench to remove the bracket on the underside. To set the drive up, it's very simple. Plug in your power adapter and your Thunderbolt cable, and they both go right into the back. The power adapter goes in on the bottom, and your Thunderbolt cable goes into either one of the ports in the back. As soon as we plug in both, we can hear the drive starting to power up. As soon as we plug the drive in, we should see it come up under devices on our uh, finder over here on the Mac, as well as uh, come up on the disk utility as a device. It's booting up right now. It takes about 8 to 10 seconds to boot up from the time that we plug it in, and here it comes up right now. So we could see it right here as the Lacy Too Big. It's the 6 terabyte model, and all 6 terabytes are available here because when we first get the Lacy Too Big and take it out of the box, we could see that it comes as a um, striped RAID set, so you get full access to both disks. The striped RAID set is the quickest RAID set. It has the fastest read-write speeds available, and it works fairly well. Um, what's also important to see here is that we could delete this and make it a mirrored RAID set simply by clicking delete, delete. And now if we go to one of the two drives that are in the too big, we could check off the RAID, make sure it's on mirrored unless we want stripe set. Let's give it a name. Now we simply drag the two drives, the two disks, right over in here. We can look at our options. I'm going to put the RAID block set to 128 because I'm going to use it for video editing. And then I'm going to hit create. 
and then click create again. You'll see it adjusting itself and then within seconds it's going to pop up as a mirrored RAID set. But because it's a mirrored RAID set we will no longer have access to our six terabytes. Each bit of data that goes on there goes on there twice. So we only have half the space which is three terabytes and you can see that right over here by clicking on the drive and seeing that it's available capacity is three terabytes. To review, if you use it as a striped RAID set, you get quicker read-write times and larger space, but no redundancy. If you use a mirrored RAID set, you will get slightly slower read-write times, but if one of the drive fails, all of your data is on the other drive. My name is Adam Watt, professor and technologist from John Jay College of Criminal Justice. This was the review of the LACI two big drive with six terabytes of storage space. Uh, stay tuned for some drive tests to see exactly how fast this drive really is.